So this little room is probably one of my favorite rooms and I know I keep saying every room's my favorite, but this probably is my favorite and that's for obvious reasons. It's this beautiful sunlight. We keep affectionately calling it the sunny room, but it's got the gorgeous sun streaming through. You're looking out to the north over the beautiful nature reserve and the garden. It's just a beautiful room. So there's, it's a little room, but it packs a little bit of punch. Um, you can see we've used oak heavily again in the room, just continuing that theme with the timber. And we've got our Corinthian motor oak, white oak doors with the designer doorware handles. And you can see we just literally match the oak face to the beautiful door. So there's a few other things in this room. Obviously we've got the oak again, steg bar uh, wardrobes from their gallery range. And they're all beautifully designed with all their mod cons and things that they need. And then letting all that light in are these fabulous Anita sashless windows. Um, one of the great things about these windows was there's a lot of planning rules that you've got to abide by when you're designing on a second story. And particularly because there's such a drop down to the ground below, you have to have height restrictions with the, the opening of your windows. So these Anita sashless are one of their new duo mode range. So it allows it to open from the top and the bottom to the legally required amount. And it just lets that beautiful air flow through without compromising your view because there's no crossbar through the middle. One of my favorite windows, these guys. And then you can see we've covered all of the windows with roller blinds, obviously for lockout. But you'll see on the other side of these guys, it's DIY range, um, their new range called Orca, and it's dark on the outside, which absorbs the heat, and so it stops the room from heating up. So it sort of has a, a double function there. But we've got these throughout the house, and then we've got our beautiful ripple fold sheer curtains, which are super pretty, just to finish it off. And then, the last sort of design element in this room is the beautiful wallpaper um, called Huddy's Dots. It's from Milton and King and it just really finishes it. And you'll notice obviously it's the same wallpaper we've got in the kids' room. So it just is that nice way to repeat materials. We love to repeat a material. So this room is a bit of a multifunctional room. So we designed it to be another kid's space. So obviously we've got the bunk room, but we wanted to have another room, perhaps more for a teenager. I've got teenage girls, so they had a bit of a vested interest in this room. But, um, you know, we wanted to create another space that was a bit multi-purpose. We also wanted to make sure we had at least four king-size bedrooms. So this also doubles as a king-size bedroom. So at the moment it's set up with those two, you know, single beds, but it can also come together as a king-size bed as well. Um, one of the key things for being able to convert that was using these beautiful half moon bed heads from Create Estate. And we worked with the team to come up with two beautiful fabrics that would work really well with the color scheme and, and give it a little bit of definition. So those sort of form the, I guess, the key functionality to being able to be really flexible with the layout of the room. And then of course, we've got all of our, you know, normal luxurious linen and Ben Boca throws and, and all those beautiful textures that help to bring it together. And again, you know, one of our favorite things to do is, is put beautiful lights in spaces. And I'll just see if this one's turned on. But you see this gorgeous barrel lamp from Clay Life. It's one of our favorite pieces in this room. And it's all made with hand, crafted mud beads, um, which is really beautiful. And they're just such lovely products. So I don't know if you've noticed, but upstairs I've been standing on carpet the whole time, which is different to downstairs, obviously. And up here we've put beautiful Cavalier Bremworth to saw in Lupine, I think is the color, uh, which is just a beautiful light gray and it's really lovely underfoot. Everybody loves a bit of carpet in a bedroom. But it's just got such a lovely feel in this room. You've got all that gorgeous natural light and beautiful outlook. It's just a really serene space, but a little bit of fun with the wallpaper and the artworks. And yeah, just a nice space to be.